Uncertainty loomed around Fort Novacell after rumors surfaced of funds diverted from the Army base. News 4's Will Polston spoke with Representative Barry Moore to find out if there was truth behind the claims. Funding has been a concern on the minds of families and soldiers at Fort Novacell for weeks. Many wondered if the base would lose nearly 93% of its funding. Everybody, I think, around the Wiregrass got notifications on May 1st through social media that there might be a change in funding. The $130 million diverted out of the $140 million uh, for some of the training programs and flight school programs at Fort Novacell. With rumors of the money going overseas. The rumor was they were going to divert some of those funds to Ukraine. The rumors made their way to D.C. Representative Barry Moore reached out to the Secretary of Defense for answers. We didn't want to see our military soldiers and our training in America put behind the needs of a foreign country. There were some cancellations of meetings that raised speculations. After finally meeting with Army general officers, Representative Moore said the U.S. government is not pulling funding. He hopes this will ease the minds of Fort Novacell families. They're investigating the rumor now, but uh, at the same time, we, it was our job to make sure that we didn't put a halt on funding. We, we want to make sure that the local military there in the, in the region, the Wiregrass, we continue to train and be ready for the mission, whatever that mission may be. In Dothan, I'm Will Polston, your hometown news leader. Representative Moore says the Army confirmed no training programs have been halted or disrupted at Fort Novacell.